Now, the next um, counting rule is the combination. So, when we say combination, um, it is when the number of combinations of n objects taken n at a time. So, ang kaning combination or combination rule allows one to count the number of experimental outcomes when the experiment involves selecting from a set of n objects. So, kana siya ang imuhang combination. N meaning the total number of objects. So, makuha ni mo ang combination. Gamit ani nga formula. So, you have your dako na N and your gamay na N. So, siya N, gamay na N. So, your dako na N is from a set of N objects. So, meaning pila ka buok imuhang sample points. Your total number of sample points. Ang N nga gamay is pila ra ang imuhang gi ihap. So, kana siya. Pila ra ka buok ang imuhang kailangan na mara mong gi ihap. So, um, N, ang pagkuha niya is your capital N, niya ay factorial ninyo, which nara sa inyo hang calcul na ka ng exclamation point or your factorial. So, that is called a factorial. Divided by your small N, factorial N minus N, niya. Ang difference is ang inyo hang i-factorial. Where, oh, kani siya. Ang kaniha is, katurang, kanirang nasa babaw. Mara ni siya. So, basically, yung formula na sa combination is kani. Ah, ito ikuhan kani. But if imuha nang i-break down yung formula, ang breakdown niya is kani na. Mano nang yung breakdown. So, let's... Uh, let's have an example. Let's have an example for combination rule. <coughs> Add to ta sa, ayun yung is, because it's very many. So, kanina lang. For example, is, ang ato ang experiment. Let's start here. For example, our experiment is to inspect, diba? Or mo inspect ta, or mo select ta, o parts to test for defects. So, again, Ang ato ang i-select is to test for defects. So, for instance, your total number of products, so meaning, ang imuhang kailangan it, um, imuhang kailangan nga i-inspect is, for instance, or imuhang total nga pilianan nga i-inspect is, for instance, 5 kabuok. Now, it's not always baya nga, um, mag-inspect yun ka tanan, tagsa-tagsa, di ba? There are cases wherein mag-sampling ra ka. So, meaning, dili yun tanan, especially if you are dealing with volumes of product, dili tanan is matagsa-tagsa, yun yung mag-inspect. Muna nga, mukam in ang sampling. So, ari na din ang sa ito ang, or ano ni ang magamit sa ito ang combination, no? Pero for our purpose of discussion is igamay lang sa nato, no? So, for instance, um, out of the total number of products, again, is 5 kabuok, na 5 kabuok products, ang imuhang itest, or kailangan, um, a batch, kanin lang, a batch has 5 products. If imuhang itest, if ang kana nga batch is defective or not, so mag-sampling ka. Now, the, for time saving, or uh, para konsya, cost effective siya or time effective siya is delete na nan limang imuhang i-testing so muna duha ra ang imuhang i-test so you are only picking two you're only testing two out of the five so kung anito sa combination rule of course our five is kaning dako na n and then um our two is the gamay na n so <clears throat> Para makuha na ito itong combination. So, again, our numerator is our um, factorial for 5. 
Ah. Uh, so si XL is para siya factorial na formula no. So let's use that. If wala kay factorial, what do you mean by factorial? 'Di ba? Factorial is kanang imo ra siya i-multiply ang numbers sa mga prior niya. So meaning, if you say 5 factorial that is 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5. So man imong 5 factorial. So ana siya. If you say 2 factorial, 1 times 2. If you say 10 factorial, 1 times 2 times 3 times until times 10. So ana na siya. Man imong factorial. So, di ba? Our numerator is our factorial of 5. So Mone siya ito ang deriha, numerator. Mone siya ang sababaw. Now, our denominator is numerator. Para makita. Denominator. Now, our denominator is the factorial of our 2 or uh, our sample multiplied by the factorial of the n ato ang ato gabit ato population during the case minus our sample So, there. Our kani, ang kani siya nga part is the kaning n nga gamay. And then, this part is for the population minus sample na factorial. So, meaning, our combination then is 10 divided by 12. So, we have a combination of 10. Now, the combination here of 10 is mauna niyang imuhang number of Experimental outcomes. So, kana siya. So, for example, ani lang na to ha. Let's try to use the um, tree diagram. So, ani ni siya. For instance, ato alang ni man, ang kaninga mga five products is you are dealing with product A, A, B, B, C, D, and E. So, out of products A, B, C, D, and E, again, duha ra ang imuhang pilian. So, meaning, pwede ka, A, ani, kung duha ra tong pilian, si A is pwede iyahang paris kay si B, pwede si C, pwede si D, pwede si E. So, meaning, imuhang sample point is, imuhang sample point diri is si A, B, oops, there. Your sample point is A, B, and so on. Okay, your sample point is A, B, there is C, A, C. Oops. A C A D A E Na. Then C B C B kit sa man ang yahang wala pang pares. Di ba si B is na pares naman siya diri ni A. So yahang pwede yung pares na lang is si C or ang wala pa ma-account niya partner si C, si D o si E. So, imuhang possible na sample po or imuhang sample point is BC, BD, o BE. Diba? Now, si C, kinsa man ay ihang wala na lang ma-account na ma-partner. Diba? Si D o si E na lang. So, in this case, C, D, o C, E. Now, si D, of course, ang wala na lang ma-account ni nga partner is si E. T, E. 
Si E, na naman, na naman partner si E. Diba si E is na partner na siya ni A, na partner na siya ni B, ni C, and ni D. So, if imuha ng ipon, o, oh, diba pila ni siya kabuok, there are a total of 10. Diba, as you can see here sa count, there are 10. So, 10 kabuok combinations. Muna siya ang imuhang combination. Now, muna siya ang counting rules imuhang combination. So, there are 10 na sample points or experimental outcomes. So, again, ang purpose aning atong counting rules is to count kung pila kabuok ato ang mga experimental outcomes. Muna siya purpose ato ang counting rule.